a man every somatic cell has 23 pairs of homologous chromosome. How come about this? Every man, agree with me, come from a woman and a man. The woman produces an egg and the man produces a sperm. A sperm carries nucleus with chromo with 23 chromosomes and egg carries a nucleus with also 23 chromosomes so the sperm is having 23 chromosomes the egg is having 23 chromosomes At fertilization, the chromosomes, the two nuclei, that is the nucleus of the egg and the nucleus in the sperm, fuse together and produce, and their chromosomes now paired up into 23 pairs of chromosomes. In other words, this zygote resulting from the fertilization of the process results to forming a cell with 20, 46 chromosomes. Now, let me illustrate what we by pairs of homologous chromosomes. Homologous chromosomes are alike in shape and in size. Shape, size, and constitution. Let's assume that the, this chromosome from the mother is carrying a gene a gene for the texture of the hair on your head. The equivalent gene will be located on the chromosome of the from the father and they are in the same environment that we want to call the locus, in the same lo uh, locus. So, homologous chromosomes are alike in shape, size, constitution. That is, the genes they carry, they are alike. And these genes, will soon, when we come to genetics, we know they are the uh, carrier of the characters we transfer to the offspring. Now, what can we say about homologous chromosomes now. Homologous chromosomes are pairs of chromosomes that carry genes or genes for traits located in the same loci. Loci, what I mean, locus, loci, plural of locus. So if this is the, uh, the texture of the air, color of the air, uh, length of the air, if they are carried by different chromosomes, 
they will be located in the same locus in each of the homologous chromosomes. So homologous chromosomes are from two parents and they have they combine together in an individual in the offspring during fertilization. So that explains where we say we have 23 pairs of homologous chromosomes in our body cells.